Hello, good people. This is Van Ness JC coming at you from TraderRetreat.com. One of those trading sites on the net. This is my second time trying to start this recording. I'm having some camera issues. I'm here today with a brand new box. Gypsy Queen baseball cards. 2014 from Tops. Huge thanks to Tops for sending me the Gypsy Queen. Thanks to Trader Retreat for sending it specifically to me. Pretty excited about this. I love the Gypsy Queen. Uh, it's got old 19th century feel. Baseball cards and, uh, you know, brand new stock. Um, this is the fourth season of Gypsy Queen since they brought it back. Um, pretty excited. There are 24 packs of cards, uh, 10 cards in each pack. Unless you get a relic or a hit, uh, then you could have fewer. Also included is a mini box. There should be 10 mini cards in there. There could be autographs, there could be relics, there could be who knows what. There could be birth year penny cards in there. There could be a whole ton of things because this year Gypsy Queen is loaded. Uh, because there are a lot of packs, let's go ahead and jump right into this. And as I'm opening, I will tell you about some of the stuff that we're going to find inside. But right off the bat, let's see. Um, here we go. Starling Marte. So you're going to get the best of today out of this set and then you're going to get something like Bob Gibson the best of yesterday so a Hall of Famer uh, Bob Gibson is what you're going to be getting in these packs uh, Taro Encore Alvarez uh, in each pack there will be a mini so we're going to have 24 minis plus the 10 mini pack in there, so approximately 34 minis. And I've got a Manny Machado mini to start off the minis in the first pack. Uh, Andrew McCutcheon, Joe Maurer, and a first insert in the pack. It's a glove story of the man of the year, uh, Yankees uh, shortstop Derek Jeter. Glove stories is one of the three main insert sets in Gypsy Queen. Um, if you count minis, that would be a fourth set, but the main insert sets are um, debut all-stars, dealing aces, and glove stories. Uh, there are printing plate parallels for these. Otherwise, they are all just base insert cards. Uh, Bruce, Saran, Kasher, Butler. All right, we've got another glove story. This one is Anthony Rizzo of York. Chicago Cubs. Uh, Sabathia, Ricky Henderson, Pedro Martinez, and our mini on this one. Ooh, this is James Pax Paxton. Um, the mini, as you can see right here, is a sepia tone, and that it means it is number two fifty. There you go. You can see it on the back. Um, <coughs> And so while we're here, I will go ahead and mention that there are uh, parallels in this set. Uh, for the minis, there are black, red, sepia, wood, and then printing crate clips and leather. Um, for the base, there's not a whole lot um, <clears throat> as far as parallels go. Certain cards will have parallels. There's a blue framed set, a white framed set, which you'll only find in um, retail, and then a silver plate uh, frame set, which is a one of one. Um, but it's only 100 cards out of the set. Um, you're not going to see that out of uh, for every card. And here we go, an N174. This is also an insert set in here. Uh, let's see, I've got it written down. N174 Gypsy Queen cards. There are 15 of them, and we have pulled one. It is the Babe himself. So uh, it's pretty cool to be pulling a Babe Ruth card out of the back of cards these days. Uh, I don't care, uh, you know, how mass produced they may or may not be. It's pretty cool. Phil Rizzuto, Jim Palmer, and Joey Votto. Our mini this time around is Salvador Perez. Get focused in. All right, we are going to try to um, go through this a little faster. Um, I don't want this video to last all night as we have a lot of things to go through here. Uh, Ellen Craig, Austin Jackson, Edley Griffin. Ah, here we go. Debut All-Stars insert. This is a blue one. Uh, this is not uh, any kind of parallel or anything. It's just the border. It is blue. It is Paul Goldschmidt. <laughs> 
it is it what the debut all-star set looks like and here we go uh, we've got a matt holiday mini in this set uh, Verdroya and the wizard ozzy smith let's keep going uh, i do need to mention there are four hits in every box of <coughs> Excuse me, Gypsy Queen Baseball. Two relic cards and two autograph cards. Uh, we have yet to find any of those so far as we've been searching. Lily McCovey, Dr. Martinez, another N174. This one, a Mr. October, Reggie Jackson. I uh, like the old school black and white look at those cards. I'm thinking they're pretty cool. Uh, Yasiel Puig, near. Uh, Los Angeles Dodgers, and our mini in this one is, um, uh, this is a black mini. You see the black border, and it is number out of 199. <clears throat> so we like the minis, we like the parallels, uh, we like the number cards. I think it's pretty, pretty sweet. <clears throat> Apologize for the coughing, I, I am starting to get sick. Uh, but I didn't want to wait for it to go away to do this break. I wanted to get this thing out there as soon as possible. Uh, Mini, uh, let's see. Ethan Martin right there. And we have another insert. Uh, I mentioned earlier that we have Dealing Aces. Uh, obviously, this is going to uh, discuss some of the best pitchers in baseball or in baseball history. And there is Pedro Martinez right there. Uh, his dealing aces insert. We'll go ahead and keep going with these until we come up with some hits. There's supposed to be four of them in here. We have yet to find any, which means pretty soon this box is going to get real interesting. Love story Carlos Gomez from the Milwaukee Brewers. Mini of Anthony Rizzo from the Chicago Cubs. And I'm sure it's a whiskey base. <clears throat> this is a 350 card base set. 300 cards, regular print. The last 50, I believe, are short printed. Um, you'll find one in every four packs uh, of the 50 short prints. There are also variation cards. And essentially what they are is they are reverse image cards. Uh, so like in this case, this card of Kyle Loesch, the variation would have his glove, you know, would have him flipped around so his glove was on the other side of the card. And that is what the variation is going to look like. When I have my written review, I am going to uh, list out all the variation cards uh, that are out there. Uh, so that way, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to link you to somebody who's looked at them all up. Um, and this way, you will be able to uh, check to see if you've got any variations in Ernie Banks Mini. And another N174. This one. Yogi Berra. <coughs> so it's a uh, nice looking set. We are almost a third of the way through this thing. We still have not pulled out our first hit. So that's got, oh, looks like we got one right in here. Uh, save that one to the last. You know, suspense and all that. Uh, Adam Dunn. Uh, it shows him taking a swing there. Maybe a home run. Probably a strikeout, but it's an Adam Dunn mini. Eddie Matthews, Steve Carlton, Duke Snyder. That's pretty cool to pull those all out back to back. And our first hit of the night is Chris Medlin, a pitcher for your Atlanta Braves. This is a relic card. As you can see, that it's kind of got a weird tone to it. It's not just a single tone. It's kind of uh, almost camouflage -y looking or something there. Uh, it's kind of white blue, got a, almost like some dye got on it or something like that. It's pretty nice looking. I like it. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, we are more than a third of the way through, and that is our first hit. So we've got three more hits coming in our box of Gypsy Queen. And it looks like we may have one of them right here. But we will, uh, it's Carlos Martinez, and Mini Pedro, as we like to call him around here. Here is an N174. This one of Dodgers, uh, uh, Young Spinam Yasiel Puig, uh, Steven Strasburg, uh, Whitey Ford Mini, that's pretty cool, uh, Greg Maddox, uh, Adam Jones, Mark McGuire, 
back in the Oakland Athletics days. So that's pretty cool. <clears throat> and we have pulled, oh, look at this. We have pulled, pulled a blue parallel, a blue bordered parallel. These are number 499. Uh, and we pulled this one up, Duke Snyder. It is the base card, but it's got a blue border on it. So as you can see, it's actually got a little ridge all the way around. It's like it's a regular card with the blue border on it. So, um, not exactly a hit, which is kind of cool. That means we still got our th with three hits left, but a really, really nice <coughs> parallel there, and a really cool player to get a parallel of in uh, Duke Snyder. All right. Brian Zimmerman, Perez, the other debut All Star. Jose Fernandez just tearing things up both on the mound and with the glove uh, for your Miami Marlins. Um, many of a hey, 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 Nick Markakis, Markakis, Markakis. Uh, I'm sure that a Baltimore fan out of there is going to smack me for not to pronounce that, but it is what it is. <coughs> hey, what are you doing? Arroyo, Segura, Lance Lynn, Zahara, Dealing Aces, and this one is of Justin Verlander, an insert, so we like that. We've got a, what looks like another border card. All right, here we go. We've got a black mini, Ralph Keener, number to 199. Come on, focus. To 199, and we pulled another uh, blue border in here. Number to 499. This one, haha. -ha. Willie Stargell from the Pittsburgh Pirates. Even though I was a Cardinal fan growing up, Willie Stargell is one of my very favorite players of all time. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. I like that we're we're getting the blue borders and we're pulling the old timers. That's uh, that is pretty awesome, if you ask me. All right, let's see. Let's keep going. So we've got our first autograph. Uh, but first, a Juan Marichal mini. Jared Weaver, Space Mike Schmidt, and our first autograph. Now, uh, one thing about Gypsy Queen, um, they are on card at autographs. And our autograph, this is the Braves pitcher. Alex Wood. So as you can see there, it's a, it's, um, it's faded out at the bottom. We were just a white background, a beautiful signature centered on the card perfectly. Again, it's on card, not a sticker auto. So that is a very, very nice pull. <coughs> and it's only the first auto uh, that we will pull out of this. We should have a second one coming. Let's look at J.J. Hardy. Let's see, uh, Frazier. Another N174, this one of Clayton Kershaw. Elliot Dodgers ace, Bo Jackson. How often do you get to pull a Bo Jackson card nowadays? <laughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. Like I said, I'm getting sick. Nolan Arenado mini right there. George Brett, Reggie Jackson, Harmon Killebrew to finish the pack out. You just can't be pulling... Um, these old time superstars, along with the greats of today, uh, in these packs. Um, this is a old song, really. Murphy. And a debut All Star, another Clayton Kershaw. Uh, got his debut All Star there. Go to his N174, we pulled a minute ago. And oh, a rookie mini of Masahiro Tanaka. Let's see if he'll focus in on me now. Did I trust me? It is that many of him. And uh, James Shields and Hanley Ramirez. We're getting down to almost two thirds of the way through the box. So looking for a couple more hits. Franklin, Leak, Alvarez, Robinson. Okay, are there?
Dealing aces? What is this all about? Hmm. It's a Dealing Aces card, but it's a uh, different looking card than the ones we've pulled otherwise. Let's see if I can tell the difference. Well, it is not numbered. It is certainly silver or gray, though. Maybe it's just the... Uh, Maybe it's just the player. Maybe it's just the best on, based on the team. But we have a Dealing Aces of CC Sabathia. Notice that it's gray around the outside rather than the uh, kind of cream color that the other ones are. Have to look and see if that means anything. A Tyler Skaggs mini. Rollins Chapman, John Smoltz, and Max Scherzer. <clears throat> we are down to the last uh, eight packs or so, which is the last third of the box. Two more hits coming. Let's see what we got. Perez, Walker, Trevor Rosenthal, Reddick, Guillardo, a debut all-star. This is a red debut all-star. This must mean something. I don't know, but it is of Robinson Cano. You see it's got a red border. All the other ones had blue borders, so we'll have to before I do my written review, I will have to figure out what the colors mean because I didn't find anything on that as I was looking it up. And uh, uh, Aaron Hill, mini, three years on the Diamondbacks. Let's keep going. Got two more hits in here, one of which should be a mini relic uh, from what I'm reading. Cone, some base, some This is kind of nice. We get the gray board dealing aces, Greg Maddox, which was right in front of the mini Greg Maddox. That's so why I say that. Uh, and then followed up by Jason Hayward. So brave centric, mainly Greg Maddox centric pack there. So that's not too bad. <laughs> the last few packs here. Catfish Hunter. Oh, wow. Iglesias. Dealing Aces, this is one I will be keeping. Of Michael Waka Waka Waka, rookie phenom for the St. Louis Cardinals. A mini of Russell Martin. Nolan Ryan. Eddie Murray. So we are down to five packs, and there should be two more hits. Within these five packs, hopefully they will be a good one. Keep going. And looks like we grab another autograph there. Let's see. First off, though, a mini of Roberto Clemente, another Wizard of Oz, and Ernie Banks. This autograph is from the Seattle Mariners, Brad Maurer. Again, look at the autograph, perfectly centered on the white section, on card, beautiful autograph, beautiful card. You cannot complain at all about the quality of Jesse Queen this time around, uh, and you got to love the on card autos. Uh, whereas more and more, more and more sets, and like, ooh, uh, top sets actually, more and more are going to sticker autos. It's nice to see some still rocking the. Uh, the sweet on card autos. Another M174. This one of Mariano Rivera. Sounds look good. Captain. A mini. Zach Granke. Okay, I've got three more packs left. <coughs> We're looking for one more game you hit. Uh, that should be a mini relic. Let's keep going. Beltre, Lowry, Nacion. Glove Stories, Carl Crawford. Uh, that would be his feet as he flipped over the wall. Uh, we've got a black mini of Carlos Santana. That is number 199. And a couple more base, Cal Ripken Jr. included. Now we'll get to the last couple packs and see what we can pull out of this. 
Contingency Colton Wong, Colin Crawford base. Yes, another dealing aces. Julio Tehran, dealing aces. A mini of Adam Lind. And our last pack here, this should be, this should have a hit in it. We're supposed to get four hits. This is my last pack. Let's see what we get. I think it's going to work for us. Seagrist. Gorgeous. Owings. Smins. I don't want to see what it is. I'm going to put it down before I can see what it is. A mini of. Oh. It didn't need. Hechevaria. Anybody who's watching down in Miami, which doesn't really know about it, so uh, we will just move on to the last hit in our box, which is <coughs> kind of going to make me sick. It is a certified relic. It is a mini. It is a bordered mini. Certified relic of <sighs> the Brewers. Ryan Effing Braun. Uh, as you can see, it's it's pretty well plastic coated, so it's a huge glare coming off my cam camera. Uh, trust me when I tell you it's Ryan Braun. Trust me when I tell you I don't want a Ryan Braun relic in my collection. Uh, however, I did pull one. Uh, what, what I will say is these are beautiful cards. Uh, I do like the minis. I do like the mini relics. Uh, I like the frame. I like the kind of plastic coating. Really, really, really nice cards. I can't help that I got a, uh, a, a cheater. Uh, but I got what I got. Now, last last things last. The 10-pack of minis. Let's see what we get out of here. All right. Right off the bat, my man, Willie Stargell. Bryce Harper, Adam Jones, Cardinal, Adam Wainwright, how about Adrian Beltre, Adrian Gonzalez, Albert Pujols of the 500 home runs, Alan Craig, another Cardinal. Andrew McCutcheon, MVP. Ooh, and this one might be the best of them all. He is as hot as hot can be right now. Rookie first baseman for your Chicago White Sox, Jose Abreu. And that will do it for the 10-pack of minis. Uh, I'm going to go through here. Let's see. Is there anything else that I need to tell you about at this point? No, I think we've covered everything. There are, <coughs> like I said, there are birth card First, your penny card. So there's minis um, in the mini box that are exclusive. They are only one of ones. They are cards that will have a penny with the birth year of the player on it. Uh, there are autograph minis. There are autograph mini relic books. There are around the horn autograph pop up book cards, uh, bat barrel cards, button cards, hometown flag commemorative patches, um, printing plates all over the place, um, jumbo relics. Parallels of the mini set, variations, you name it, Gypsy Queen's got it. I'd like to shout out again to Tops for getting this over to us. A shout out to Trader Retreat for getting it over to me. Please check out Trader Retreat in the coming days for the written review, which will have scans and uh, up close looking at the entire uh, box break. And uh, please do check it out at TraderRetreat.com. Until next time, Van and SJC signing off.